Welcome to Dan's on the Street. I'm Dan. We're going to explore the world city by city as seen through Google Maps and Google Street View. I thought we could go up to Alaska today. I've actually been to Alaska, but quite a while back, and only to uh, Anchorage here, and maybe a city or two south of there. Never got up to Fairbanks. Uh, I don't know much about Fairbanks. Uh, Definitely heard of it. I had a friend in high school who went to university up here. It's kind of away from most of the mountains in the flatter area, somewhat flat. Um, thought we could check it out today. Fairbanks, Alaska. Plenty of street views. Let's uh, drop her down onto what looks like a main street. Or somewhat main. Looking at July 2009 here, so kind of old. I'm not sure if I really dropped on that main street. I think I'm adjacent to it. Um, a couple homes in here, some older vehicles. We're on Hilton Ave. All right. More kind of older vehicles. Small, single story homes. Kind of like the look of this one with the wood outside. Let's see. Which way should I go? Let's move down this way. This is Stewart Street. Freshly paved sidewalk there. That's great. Kind of looks like we're near a school, maybe. Oh, definitely a school. Looks like a nice little school. Um, Crasson Avenue. Crasson? Let's check out this guy's vehicles. He's got several. Oh man, classic jet ski here. And then a newer one. Awesome truck. And a motorcycle. And a couple tables for fun. Yeah. Uh, I think that's a fun guy who lives there. Great flowers out here. So we're looking at July, so we're well into the the short summer that is up here. I don't know how many warm months they have, but um, probably painfully few. September, pretty out, but uh, I'm sure the cold's coming. Tons of snow here. Uh, looks like a hotel, maybe. Maybe apartments. Pretty trees out here, though. This would definitely be a, a nice time to visit, I'm sure. Still good light. Um, obviously the trees. And then still pretty warm. Yeah. What a pretty street this is with all these trees there. Kellum Street. All right, we're back into July. Pretty quiet town, at least in this area. Smaller homes. Um, Link Estates, or Lenick? Link, I think. Interesting. A couple swings out there. Okay. Some of these homes are kind of neat, back in the trees. And um, yeah, obviously plenty of trees around here. Let's pop up and see if we can get a better sense of this town. So these streets, clearly, this is amusing, follow the path of the river. I bet the original streets were like down close to the river and then it slowly spread out. I don't know. It's kind of interesting to see nature dictate the roads. Looks like a factory up here or some sort of plant. Yeah, not sure. I'm sure it employs a bunch of people up here. Definitely could see some distant hills. I said we're not near the mountains. I, I'm speaking relative to other parts of Alaska, which are super mountainous. I saw a few myself in near Anchorage, and oh my god, they're amazing. Cute home here, little blue place. Definitely rural country. What's happening here? <laughs> it's little horses. Um, Pretty awesome view of this house with that factory back there. That'd be a neat shot in a movie, I feel like. Just this steam coming up behind it. Um, yeah, but it feels very kind of country living out here. Huge camper van. A couple additions on this house, it looks like. All right. Fairbanks. It's not really on a 
you know, I guess maybe the fair banks of the river. But we're not near the ocean. Oh, and there's a bigger river down here south. This is the Tanana River. It kind of marks the southern border, I think, of the town. And then maybe some farming up here a little bit. Not a ton. Let's check out this Creamer's Field Migratory Waterfowl. That sounds interesting, I think. Not sure what that means exactly. Creamery Lane. Oh, okay. All right. It's a dairy farm. Yeah, you got it. Looks like a little festival happening today. I'd definitely visit that. I like checking out farms like this. Wonderful old tractor there. All right. Yeah. All right, let's pop back up. I don't know if I want to drive down that whole street. Um, it's pretty cool. Another shop up here. Oh, petting zoo. Okay. We're in College Road, so we must be near the college. Um, or one of the colleges. I don't know if there are multiple. Pretty spread out town. Oh, love this little creek going through here. I'm sure there's just unbelievable fishing up here. Uh, look at this boat. Great color on that. Yeah, this. if you live up here, you. I feel like a boat and camping gear, hunting gear, if you're into that, um, you're going to have all that in stock because this is the place to do it. Nice. More little like animals in the yard, okay. Maybe that's uh, a trend here. It's like a bunch of businesses down in here, cabs, all right. Tons of little lakes even, look at all these lakes. Everywhere there's a lake. Let's uh, see if we can see one of them. Well, maybe let's look past these houses, see if we can catch that. Not too much. Some huge antennas here. I like the look of this place. That's kind of cool. Some slightly bigger homes in this area, it seems like. Just a little bit. Everything's, you know, it's got a second floor. Big garages. A lot of... Have you noticed all the garages and even, like, kind of big ones, I feel like? Oversized garages. A lot... Well, okay, let's think about it. It's freezing cold. They get so much snow, so that makes sense. You're going to want to be able to park your car inside. Plus, you got the space for it, but yeah. When you have a few feet of snow coming down, if you could avoid shoveling that, you still have to clean off the sidewalk or the parking spot. Old truck there. Everyone's got a yard. Um, it's kind of neat in here. Surrounding a lake, and then surrounded by a river. Surrounded by more lakes, okay. So many lakes. Oh, here's the airport. Fairbanks International Airport. Very close to town. There's even a lake in the airport. Um. Oh my god. Oh, right, so there's seaplane. This is, this is a runway. I thought it was just like a lake. Um, for no reason. Look at all these um, sea boats, seaplanes, I mean. Fantastic. Oh my god, yeah, this is the state for seaplanes. This is, they're big into that. Uh, I've seen it in the movies, at least, right? Very cool. Oh, I'd love to go for a ride and just land on a river or the ocean or something. I don't know how it works. A bay. Um, that's cool. <laughs> That's pretty unusual. Um, okay, let's check out... Let's go down this airport way a little bit. Yep, easy highway or... to the airport. Safeway. Liquor store. Rahan's Liquor. This politician's sign is, like, bigger than his sign. 
Midas. First National Bank. You know, pretty standard businesses along here. A few chains. Big Ray's. Annex and Clearance Corner. Okay. Not sure what I'd do there. AIH. You know. Nice wide streets, though. A few churches. Palace Theater. I wonder what that is. Well, this looks like an amusement park here, right? There's like a boat. What is happening? I think I might be inside that boat, looking at a miniature. This is, feels super meta. Like, I'm like... <laughs> okay, alright. Let's get out of there. That's... That's kind of weird. Um, clearly an amusement park of some sort here. Uh, maybe... Is that a Ferris wheel in the center? Can't tell. I still can't tell. This doesn't quite feel like it's from the same area, but maybe it is. A place to... definitely a place to bring family. Oh, an air museum? Absolutely, I'd visit that. Yeah, i check out this whole thing. I'm not sure what it is. It's just like a collection of... I can't tell if it's like one entity or several things. Oh, here... oh wow, we're inside that airplane thing. Oh man, this is awesome. What a cool space they have here. Some model planes, even. Oh, I'll definitely come here. So great that somebody uploaded this photo. Ah, uh, I'm a, yeah. Big fan of airplanes. That's awesome. All right, let's check over on this street here. That looks like a museum or two. Which way should we go? I wanna go this way for a bit, and then maybe I'll come back. peek down here, because this is cool. If I can. Oh, well, maybe I can't. Mecca... Does I say Mecca bar? I can't tell. <laughs> uh, uh-huh. Ivory. Okay. Interesting. Kind of cool look to this building. Post office. Okay. Yeah, great looking post office. If only a fine store. <laughs> Uh, I think I kind of know what to picture in there. Might still walk in. I mean, it looks like super friendly. Yeah, good number of like little shops in this part of town. Kind of old, or, you know, some of this is a hundred years old. Some of it a little newer, but great, great shops though. Men's clothes. I mean, I love that sign. Museum. Oh, here's a museum. The Fairbanks Community Museum. Oh. We'll definitely come here, check out the, uh, you know, it's super helpful if you're in a small town that has, like, the town museum. You will enjoy your, your time at that town so much more if you can check out their local museum. You, like, learn a little history and you'll appreciate it vastly more. Um, I was recently in Elgin, Illinois. Visited the museum. I, I thought nothing of the town. Visited the museum and was like amazed the whole rest of the time there. I was like, oh, that's so awesome. I was like looking at stuff, recognized some names on streets. It was fantastic. This is cool here. A little. Oh, wait. It's just an outdoor. They got like seat, outdoor seating at the pub. Um, church there, sure. Terminal Street. Well, we're back in 2007. This is some of the earliest stuff you'll find um, in Google Maps. And doesn't the world look dark and dreary back then? And hey, a little better already. 2009. Back out. Um, okay, this is kind of interesting. Hmm. <laughs> Let's go down another street just nearby, 3rd Ave. Very, uh, kind of cute. Somebody's put a lot of love to this little house. Flowers everywhere, flag out and all that. More character here. Kind of cool place here. Oh, I like this a lot. 
This is like hiding, I think, a really interesting home in there. Like, it's interesting on the outside. I bet it's pretty cool on the inside, too. That skylight like that. Third Ave. Is this a house here? Looks like a tiny house. Yeah, I get it, I get it. Let's see here. So this is the Chenna River. Winds for miles and miles, all the way down, joins up with the larger river. Okay. Let's check out somewhere by this airport to see what's nearby. Uh, maybe we'll drop down into a neighborhood here. Interesting. Classic scene here. These guys look awesome. <laughs> Just having fun time. Um, interesting. Nice little neighborhood up in here. Somewhat, new, somewhat newer homes, or like they all look like they're from the whatever 80s, 90s, maybe a little bit earlier. Again, some distant hills. Haven't seen much snow yet. They seem to. I guess the, it's easier for the Google Street View cars to come through when there's not snow on the ground. But I feel like we're not getting a a full and fair representation of this town. That definitely there. Big portions of the year, this is gonna have snow on it, which is fine. But you gotta, you gotta be aware of that. Fairbanks. Wonder what this co-op market grocery deli thing is. Kind of neat, circular-shaped building. Oh no, this kind of looks closed, right? Maybe. Maybe it's just like the backside. I hope. Hair Palace. <laughs> All right, that's fun. Huh? Oh, maybe it's not closed. Okay. The way these windows—I think these are supposed to be windows, probably. And they boarded them all up. It might, you know, doesn't it seem like that? So it kind of looks closed, but there's people parked there, so maybe not. Big Daddy's Barbecue. I definitely hit that up. Cushman Street. Oh. Nice fire station. That's really... That was expensive. It's nice to have such a cool space. Whoa. Look at this. Four bucks a gallon. July 2011. He's on the ladder. He's about to raise it. Uh, that's kind of steep. Another church here on the right. Big cross. Saddlers. Home furnishings. All right, you know, get a chair. Great mural here. If we can see it. 2011. It was even here in 2009. I like that. Beautiful mountains. Yeah, I'll definitely do some serious camping and hiking here. Snack shack? I don't actually even see that snack shack. Where is it? Oh, it's in here. Okay. Hmm. Maybe. McKinley Bank. 59 degrees in July. So, yeah, not too warm here. Could be morning time. Kind of looks morning, right? Alaskan Motor Inn. I was hoping to get one more glance at the temperature just to see on another day. 69 in July. Well, that's a little better. All right, have we been here already? This kind of looks familiar. Maybe not. A couple more places and I'm gonna call it a day here. Huge mall up here, Walmart, College Road, oh, Fountainhead Antique Auto Museum, 
definitely some cool stuff to see up in this part of town. Hamilton Acres. Let's drive by this mall. You know you'd end up here at some point if you lived in town. Hmm. Kind of an old looking mall. The Bentley Mall. Oh, some of these storefronts have been updated. Sure. Hills back there. Oh, the skiing too. I don't really ski, but I, I, I could see getting into it for sure. And this would be a great town for that. It's pretty flat though, down in here. Um, a little raised portion here over a river. Beautiful sky. I'm sure that, yeah, I'm sure you get epic sunsets and like just the clouds. Got the auroras up here. Fantastic, you know, sky watching, stars, all that is going to be a great time up in Alaska. Bring a telescope. Let's see. One or two more places. One or two. Oh, is there... Oh, yeah, there's another airport on this side of town. I wonder if this is military, because this says Fort Wainwright. Does it look like military? Hmm. Not necessarily. All right. Maybe it's just another airport. They got two of them here. Oh, there's definitely an army base of some sort there. Community hospital. This is pretty. Something nice about this one. I don't know. Feels nicely set back. Got some chairs outside. A little closed in front porch. Looks like a nice place. This one turned into a pile of dirt. <laughs> 2009. And where was it? 2011. New house. Very cool. And back to a pile of dirt. Um, obviously, not in that order. That's pretty nice. Glass Park. Mm, okay, real quick. No? Never mind. You missed your chance, Glass Park. Alright, somebody upload a picture from Glass Park, because Google's got none. Um, one more place. Here we go. Bureau, Bureau Land of Management. That doesn't sound too exciting. Hey, maybe we'll get a glance of it, though. Thought we'd check out this bridge. Some biking. Um, dude, that kind of looks like my friend. I don't know. He's got the right hair. Um, that'd be amazing. I don't know what happened to him. Kind of vanished. Uh, beautiful river. Look at this rainbow coming through here. Awesome sight. Lovely trees. This is a nice town. I, I don't know um, when I'll get up here. I would love to visit. Um, getting into Anchorage is a little easier, I think. Although maybe flights just go up to Fairbanks just as easy. But I definitely want to get back. I really enjoyed it. I was here for, I was again in Anchorage for two weeks or so and really enjoyed my time. Couldn't believe the sights of all of it. And I visited in March, so it was still freezing. I got to come here in September or, you know, July and really get a better experience of the place. Sort of up here, a little elevation, can look down on things. Distant hills, yeah. Bring a pickup truck, maybe rent one, and go for some go for some awesome drives. That's pretty cool. Well, I'm gonna add it to our list here. Edit, add a place. Um, Fairbanks, Alaska. Still not sure what that banks. I guess just the banks of the river being fair. I don't get that. Um, cool place. Definitely want to come back to Alaska. I'm sure I'll record some more. There's so many towns I, you know, don't really know anything about. 
Homer. I feel like I've heard of Homer. Um, oh yeah, some of this stuff over here, getting towards Russia. Um, oh yeah, I'll be back. Don't worry. Uh, let me know what I missed too. If there was something cool, I'll come back and check it out. Please subscribe, tell your friends, and uh, you know, check out some of the other videos I recorded. Got all around the world, slowly. Where should I go next? Hmm. We'll see. Alright, till next time.